I have much to attend to. Who dares to disturb me? Greetings. It was Eunuch Zhang who spread the dubious elixir across the land, was it not? It seems you cannot talk your way out of conviction this time. So you have already thrown away your humanity. Have you no respect for your superiors, Cao Cao? To sneak into my manor and disturb my work. In return for your discourtesy, I shall just have to make do with your team. Z- 
Yes? I'll give you half of all of it! <clears throat> uh, With all this, I can finally forge an empire to last a thousand years. <clears throat> This will bring forth a new wave of chaos on the land. If this is what has been destined, so be it. I shall just have to fight tooth and nail until the flames of chaos are quelled.
I shall not allow my status as a mere advisor to hold me back any longer. The House of Han is on its knees. It no longer has the power to unite the nation. That is why... I, Xiao Chao, shall bring down the evils of old and bring peace and prosperity to the land. What is needed now is a tactical mind unimpeded by morality. If you wish for an ally to walk beside you through the ravages of war, simply call upon this unscrupulous hero. For like Ju Chue, we shall soar through the sky engulfed in righteous fire! upon us. I must leave the capital and begin preparations. Mengdu, we are always at your service. Looks like it's finally time for our men to get to work. The secret of the elixir's whereabouts was taken by Zhang Rong with him to his grave. Elsewhere, Dong Zhou, a man whose ambition outweighs his conscience, brought the capital to its knees by force. Both Yuan Shao and Cao Cao suspected him to be connected to the elixir and forged a plan to bring him down. These two great eminences lit the way and drew many to gather. They amassed a colossal force comprised of 18 separate armies to stand against Dong Zhuo. Remember your face? Uh huh? Mm -hmm. May glory find you once more on the battlefield today. <clears throat> Our foes are strong as well. Hmm. 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 You said your name was Hong Jin? Can I ask you to attend to the wounded? You propose I flee to Meiwu Fort with the elixir? My lord, I, Lu Bu, will hold the enemy back and buy you the time you need. You do that, Lu Bu. 